100 jams where hit music lives. Locked in a midday chop up right here with your girl Erin Rain Man. It's all about 1130. Letting you know what's happening at Chat Trap. Because a lot's been going on over the weekend. And you know, here in the Bahamas, we received the first batch of the COVID-19 vaccine. Oxford AstraZeneca on Sunday, according to the Office of the Prime Minister, which said the first batch will include 20,000 doses of the vaccine donated from India. I didn't know we was getting it from India, but um, Minister of Health Renward Wells, he said that the Bahamas will likely use the first batch of vaccines to give the first dose to a quarter of the population. And the government has assured vaccination will be voluntary. So it's still a choice, people. And um, I know a lot of health workers definitely was not excited about this. And I don't know if a lot of people really going to stand in line and really want to get the vaccine. But hey, we're going to see what happens because in China, police made 80 arrests at a factory allegedly making fake vaccines. I'm just saying, you know, Chinese, they, they, they definitely know how to make some fake stuff. But <laughs> going after the vaccine, I think that's a little bit too, you know, that's a little too extreme right there. But it was, um, I think, 3,000 doses were found. And there's about three Chinese that were there. And, you know, they were detained at a warehouse in South Africa. So, yeah, uh, these vaccines, I don't know. I don't know, if the Chinese making the fake ones, then how are we really sure this is the real ones? Uh, oh boy, it's definitely going to be a long one. But nonetheless, you know, COVID-19 is still out there, so you just want to remember to social distance, wear your mask, and stay sanitized. That's it for Chat Trap, letting you know what's going on in the media. Just stay safe out there. Got that new Kodak Black right now, last day in.